Last month, an app zoomed up the charts in China. It's called Zao. It's an artificial intelligence app that people can upload pictures of themselves into. Kerry Allen studies Chinese social media for BBC monitoring. And they can then be put onto clips from TV programmes, movies, and it more or less looks like somebody is, is in a movie or in a TV programme. She noticed that a lot of the clips that Zhao produced looked very convincing. For instance, a viral video of one young Chinese man being transformed flawlessly into Leonardo DiCaprio in Titanic. And there were more. So I've seen examples of Chinese people's faces being superimposed onto characters in Game of Thrones. And it's been a big, exciting app in China. There's been lots of people saying, wow, this is really cool that we've reached this level of artificial intelligence now where I can literally feel like a movie star. There's a name for this kind of technology. It's called deep fakes. And within a short space of time, it's turned from a curiosity, something you may have heard about that's on the horizon, to something that can be harnessed by millions of people using their smartphones. But along with the rapid development of deep fakes has come serious worries. The clips of Zhao users turning themselves into movie stars are not 100% convincing, but within a couple of years, some people say maybe just the next 12 months, there will be deep fake technology that is indistinguishable from video reality. <laughs> 